Hello and welcome to another Kit Plus TV show supported by Media Proxy. Now, doesn't time fly? The last time we chatted to today's guest was way back in the summer of 2020 when they gave us a great overview of their camera range. And of course, nothing stands still in the camera market. So we thought it was time to catch up with Christian Kuhn from uh, Dreamchip, who produced the Atom cameras. Hi, Christian. Good to see you again. Hey, fellas. Good to see you too. So, Christian, we saw in the news very recently um, that you've got a new camera. Now, for those that uh, didn't catch that, tell us the new features uh, we can expect from the Atom One Mini Zoom. Yeah. So, thank you very much uh, that you're having me. And uh, we have a new little camera, which is over here. That's our little Atom One Mini Zoom. And uh, we have mm -hmm. some cameras that are usually with a fixed focal lens, like the Atom One Mini over here. And uh, our customers wanted to have a zoom version. And we were really searching long time to have a proper zoom because uh, you can make so many mistakes if you're taking the wrong one. So this is the Atom One Mini and it starts with 130 degree and goes to 66. So as you see here, this is the 130. And then you have the optical zoom. You can zoom in. And if I would zoom in now, you only would see uh, over here in the middle, the back. And that's the reason we panned a little bit the camera to the right. And the next shot is a closer look of me drinking the beer at 66 degree. It's very lightweight, the camera, but as you know, all our products are very, very robust. It has on the back the normal HD SDI. And this, as you know, all our Atom One Mini has the high rows where you can have RS485 and power. It has, of course, our multi matrix and match it to other cameras. HDR is one of our topics. It can do HLG, PQ, and S Log3. And uh, over here, you see all the specs from the camera. So is it, is it, uh, uh, uh... Is it an optical zoom? Is it a digital zoom? How have you fit, fitted this into such a small little package? Yeah, so very important, that's not a digital zoom. So uh, this camera is uh, based on the Atom One Mini. And uh, as okay. we were searching for a very tiny zoom, but with good glass in it, it was a long story, I can tell you. <laughs> and it's... Uh, yeah. a, only a zoom there's no digital zoom at all so it's only uh driven by glass where are you expecting end users are going to use this atom one mini zoom what are what are your typical customers so our typical customers are actually uh, you know they place this camera um, in racing cars they place this camera on a helmet everywhere where big broadcast cameras don't fit so behind the goal or somewhere. And uh, customer were really asking for Zoom because to just zoom in a little bit. So I think the goal uh, for soccer, for example, or uh, I mean, look at it together with the BR remote head. It's so small. It's, we call it the smallest PDZ around the world. Uh, whoever have a smaller version, right. please let me know. <laughs> <laughs> so I think in radio stations where you don't have so much space, you can place it. Or any any TV show where you just need a small camera, which a wide angle has, and then can zoom in smoothly. So Christian, how are you controlling the zoom? Is it purely manual or you've got remote control of that, of that zoom? So actually, the control of the zoom, as you see, it's... You don't have a, a control by hand. You can control it via RS485 over here on the back. So you have all the different players out there who has an RCP like Skahoy, SignView, and uh, they can control our uh, Atom One Mini Zoom. And together with the BR remote head, you can use it uh, with the BR remote RCP and the joystick as well. Mm -hmm. Or if you uh, want to use it with our software, of course, you can use this as well. Well, you've stuck here with rolling shutter over global shutter. Have you got any uh, plans to change? Have you got any, uh, uh, you know, any any uh, reasons why you've stuck with rolling shutter? Well, I wouldn't say we're stuck with rolling shutter because uh, over here we built in a rolling shutter that you can 
uh, work with 25 frames or you can go up to 60. And we've just been on a Super Bowl uh, with plenty of the rolling shutter cameras and there was not only one recommended a global. Of course, we have global shutter, but these cameras are much more bigger. And uh, out there in the market, yeah. uh, it's really tough to find a small global shutter. And that's the reason we, we just built yeah. Spectrum 1, which is the smallest global shutter you yeah. have for an HD camera. And, and this one has the rolling shutter, but uh, please give it a go and uh, tell me if you really see yeah. that typical shutter rolling over there, it's not visible. So when's the uh, the camera going to be shipped out? I, I, I heard a mention of NAB earlier on. Is that the timeline you're working towards? Yeah. So we are always a big fan of rolling out a camera at a show. <laughs> and we wanted to present it at IBC. IBC was cancelled. We wanted to present it at yeah, Hamburg yeah. Open over here in Germany. That got cancelled. And uh, so as we're a big fan of rolling out a camera at a show to see straight reaction and uh, the press releases, et cetera, et cetera, we're going to launch this now at NAB. And yeah, uh, there are a lot of people actually who already got interested in that camera and uh, we start shipping at NAB. Yes, that's correct. And as far as people in all of the different regions, as far as them finding out where they can buy it, do they visit your your own website? Yeah. Um, so on atom-one.de, we have over there the buy section. And there you find all our reseller. Get a demo from them. Try out our cameras. Try them with other brands, please. Compare um, because we have built in our own multi-matrix. And that's the key feature of all our cameras. And you can really match them to a Sony, Panasonic, Creswell, whatever you have out there in the field. And then you can match them. And of course, you can compare, compare it much better to other brands. So please go to our website, atom-one.de. And there, go to the resellers, give them a call, and please get a demo. Or visit us at the NAB. <laughs> Brilliant. Thank you, Christian. It's, it's good to talk to you again. And we really mustn't leave it this long. Um, until we chat to you again, and obviously, hopefully, we'll see you at uh, in Vegas in uh, in April. So do check out uh, the website for more information. Uh, thank you to Media Proxy for their support, of Kit Plus TV, and thank you for watching. Don't forget subscribe to the channel and do check out the podcast versions of these shows if you're on the move. You can go to kitplus.com/podcast. We'll see you next time.